Anna here in Stockholm. Today we are visiting Creative Technology Northern Europe. Let's find out what type of systems they are using. So, let's go! Creative Technology creates and delivers advanced 360-degree technical solutions for live events and system integration in the corporate, entertainment and sports markets. Their experience extends to a large number of national and international projects, such as festivals, congresses, arena productions, golf tours, leadership summits, music and sports competitions. Their long experience and in-depth knowledge in combination with innovative solutions mean that creative technology has what it takes to realize any event, regardless of the size, industry and geographical location. Creative Technology Group has a global footprint of 32 offices in 17 countries in Europe, North America, Asia, Australia and the Middle East. The Northern Europe offices are located in Sweden, Norway, Finland and Denmark. Today we bring the brand new AW U160 PTZ camera to the space, a digital culture center in Stockholm. Let's find out what type of PTZ systems are required for such installations. Hi Gustav. Hi, good, nice to meet you. Nice Welcome to meet to you. Space. Come follow me and I'll show you around. Sure. So what is this space used for? Um, it's kind of like a multi-arena where you can host e-sport events, TV shows, corporate events in general. Space Arena is uh, like a collaboration between uh, Creative Technology and Pop House, where Creative Technology uh, is the technical supplier and uh, for, for all the tech installed and uh, system integration. So and which equipment have you chosen to install in this uh, space? So the PTZ cameras from Panasonic, we're using the UE-150 model. Which features, for example, do you like the most in the UE-150 cameras? I really enjoy the feature where you can get two feeds out of one 4K sensor. And you, so you can use one close-up and one wide shot at the same time from the same camera. Maybe for those who don't know, can you explain what creative technology is specialized in? Of course, uh, Creative Technology is part of the NEP group and we specialize in audio, video and uh, lighting solutions for live events and uh, system in integrations. During the summer months we focus a lot of, on festivals, concerts and uh, music tours and during uh, the rest of the years it's a lot of corporate events, all from remote meetings to large exhibitions. The Olympics, for example, it's, it's a high profile uh, event as well as the Eurovision Song Contest. And when you choose the equipment for such productions and such projects, what is key for you? Well, reliability is, of course, one of the most important parts. And how Panasonic equipment has presented itself uh, in this sense? Yeah, so we've been using Panasonic cameras for several years. They're evolving. New products comes with uh, new features and uh, it's good for the future. Speaking about new products and innovation, there is something that we have to show to you, as you know. It's a brand new uh, PTZ camera, UE160, that is uh, about to come in 2023. So let's go and check it out in the control room. Yeah, I'm excited. So Gustav, let me introduce you our new flagship. This is uh, AWE160. PTZ camera that comes on top of uh, UE150 cameras that you have been already working for a while. So basically it sets a new standard. Thanks to the new sensor, the camera now can achieve a F14 sensitivity that previously was only possible with the studio cameras. And we believe with this, uh, production teams can work in the challenging light conditions. Having a larger sensor on the PTZ cameras is of course good in these environments where you use perhaps darker light to get a good picture quality. We usually mix broadcast cameras and, uh, and the PTZ as well. So if they can match uh, better, it's of course welcome. What do you think about working with LED walls? Of course, we use a lot of LED walls during our productions and uh, there's always the risk of uh, getting the moiré effect when shooting against a wall. Then I believe you will like the feature that U160 has. It's a new optical low-pass filter that reduces more effect. So 
I believe then uh, working with LED walls will not be a problem and Moira will not uh, kill any picture. Excellent. Um, what about the latency of the camera? This is a good question because thanks to the new engine that we share with Lumix DSLR cameras, the latency of the camera has now been improved. And on top, thanks to the cutting edge uh, face detection autofocus, the camera is now able to capture fast moving objects and the focus has been improved. I like that you have improved the uh, autofocus that enables the, the, control, the remote controller to, to focus on other things. UE160 now uh, supports full bandwidth NDI and on top, thanks to the optional uh, software, it will also include ST2110 uh, protocol. Currently we're using NDI quite often because you're not able to pull cables uh, to all different areas and rooms. So enabling us to go over network, we can uh, easily access our remote areas. I would say I would put the uh, UE160 on most of my productions. Thank you, Gustav. Looking forward to see the camera in action, maybe at Creative Technology Northern Europe. Over almost 15 years in the PTZ field, we continue to build the future together with our customers. By introducing new products, unlocking new features, and also by putting together a complete PTZ ecosystem to further increase the production value of video content. I hope you enjoy the day today with us and Creative Technology. Stay tuned and see you soon!